Hi, uh, my name is Marie. I'm Mike and Elaine's daughter. And I want to thank everybody for coming today. It means a lot to Mike and Elaine. And I want to congratulate everybody for 10 years at the center, at the Adler Aphasia Center. I want to thank especially Karen um, Tucker for being the heart and soul of the Adler Aphasia Center and all the therapists for all the great work that they do. And I want to thank all the donors and everybody that's here. And I hope you have a fabulous time tonight. Now I'd like to uh, wish a happy 10 year anniversary to the Adler Aphasia Center. Um, and really congratulate them on the work that they have been doing in our community. This is a groundbreaking place even though it's been in existence for 10 years. Bringing a voice back to those that lost their voice and with the voice comes confidence. Without that I, I, you, you could just find yourself in a box. Without the donors there is no center. Every day I get a little better it's because of the stuff I do there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I mean, I mean you know, it, it just doesn't help people with aphasia. It helps their families, too. For those who send us money, even if they send us $10, that person was kind enough to think of us. And we really do appreciate anything that is done in our behalf. It's unbelievable. A huge thank you. Bless you all. I mean, this has been a gift from, from all of you. I think what amazing is the people that work at the Aphasia Center. They got a great group of people. You feel that they're actually helping the people and really enjoying helping the people. I thank our volunteers every day that I see them because without our volunteers we could never afford to open and do all the services. If you just go in any time unannounced and you just walk around you see people making jewelry, you see people on the computer, you see people talking to each other, you see people preparing food. Just be part of the world again. That's really the amazing thing. We invite you all to come and visit us because we know that you support us, but once you come in here and see what we're doing, you'll leave with a happy heart. I think it's a fabulous day. All kinds of things that this group has accomplished here, it's kind of miraculous. Volunteers are true angels. I mean, they come in here with their heart and their soul, and they give their time and effort, and they form relationships that are so important to our folks with aphasia. To our volunteers, a huge thank you and a hug for caring so much about our folks with aphasia. Aphasia is still not necessarily a known word in the English language, although over the last 10 years, it's become more of a known word. And that's due to my in-laws, the people who work there, the donors, the volunteers, it's, it's a team effort. Thank you, thank you. What you do is important. Um, without that help, people who can't afford to come to the center won't come, and they'll be isolated in their homes. These 10 years for me is remarkable, and I think this is the start of a, a lot of very, very good things, both here and internationally, and thank you. One of the things that I think the Edwards Center has to be proudest of is their role in developing other centers and sending their message out to other places as well. I look at it and I say, boy, look how not just where they've come, but look where they can go. I'm enormously grateful to people that helped us. But I just say, there's so much more to do.